Let's see what happens. Oh my- Whoa! <laughs> that, was- that was so much damage. So, Asta, we've been mm-hmm. prepping up a little bit, and uh, we've got ourselves a don't die to the cannon kit here, huh? Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. So apparently, according to Fallen Breath, we should be able to survive. Well, we should be able to survive with all this kit right here, a single arrow, and potentially up to two arrows. And then the third arrow should kill us. I want to try three. Yeah. We should survive three. You want to start with three? I was thinking we could start with one. No, no, but I definitely want to try to survive three. You want to you see if you can survive three with all this stuff right here? Because we got, what do we got? We got projectile protection armor all the way across. We got a shield. We got a golden apple. Unfortunately, we don't have any natch apples, which that would actually make a pretty big difference, but they are very hard to come by. I've gotten one in this whole world, and I already used it to test the rail cannon before. And wow. we've got resistance four from potions of the turtle master. And this is the max level with glowstone, right? Uh, yeah, that's the max level of resistance four right there. This so, should be fun. So you want to you want to just don all this, and you want to see if you can survive three arrows? Definitely. All right, all right. Go ahead and do that, and I will. Uh, I'll fly up there, and we'll shoot you with the rail cannon. I uh, I actually haven't fired this thing in a while. I'm really excited. Fire. No way. That killed you? Yeah. Wow. One shot? One arrow. What just happened? You just died, man. You didn't use three, did you? No, I used one arrow. That is ridiculous. The shield didn't take any damage. The armor took... This is with unbreaking. It took... The helmet took over half damage. And the rest of the armor took slightly less than... About a third of the damage. You, you did all all of that. And so my shield didn't stop it. Yeah, you, nothing seemed to stop it. It Well, the shield should have worked, so maybe I wasn't standing in the right spot. Maybe. Fire. Checking my position. Oh. Fire. It hit my shield. Okay, I live. Oh, you lived. Okay. I lived. And my armor took no damage. Oh, my God. Your armor the took shield. No... Oh, you gotta come down here. It, your armor took no damage. My shield completely blocked it. Check that shield out. Oh! <laughs> wow, that is a lot of damage on that shield. So twenty-five my... out of three thirty-six. And uh, um, I'm ready for two arrows this time. You ready for two arrows? Yeah. All right. You think you can survive I two arrows? Don't think I'm gonna live to. No. My shield is ready. Fire. Yeah. <laughs> uh, your shield did not take damage. There's a very specific spot you've got to stand in then. But you, you think you got a good feel of where you need to stand with the shield? I think so. <laughs> it just proves how hard it is to survive this thing, man. Yeah. All right, you ready? Yep, Bernie's all over B. Uh, did you drink the potion and everything? Yep. Firing. You're good. I don't think my shield did anything. Really? Incoming. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh! I, uh... I cheated. You had a totem. I forgot I had a totem! I, w- I would have died, though. And my shield didn't take any damage. That is hard. I am ready for you to load up two arrows. All right, firing one arrow. All right, I got potion, apple, fire when ready. Firing. I'm going to die. Yeah, I died. The shield lived, so I don't think you got hit. Yeah, that's, that's tough, man. A resistance works. It's an effect that reduces by 20% per level. So level four gives us 80% immunity. Wow. And we're still dying to it. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. That's, that's plus, some important information. I realize how hard this is. Plus the projectile protection. Oh, okay. Let me check that too. Plus extra hearts. This is a lot of damage. So our projectile protection will reduce our damage by 8% per level. But full armor doesn't really benefit you. Really? Um, yes. So we get 8% times the level, which is 32% damage reduced, mm -hmm. times 4, which is above 100%. The cap is 80%. Ah, okay. So we're reducing our damage to zero by 80, plus whatever our shield absorbs is reduced by 80%. So when the shield is taking damage, i.e. when I had that first arrow hit me and my shield hit it properly, that's why my armor took no damage, is because the shield completely absorbed the damage. I didn't even take any health damage. Huh. So ideally, we should be able to survive two, but surviving three is probably impossible. OK. Builds up. Fire when ready. All right, firing. Nope. Shields up. You're good. Firing. I want to live. Oh. I didn't I know it didn't. That's too bad. I, I, I know the shield didn't hit. So we're having a lot of trouble with the shield. I'm not sure what we can do with that. Do we, we're, we've kind of run out of ideas, haven't we? I'm just going to try and keep realigning myself over time. All right. <laughs> All right, I was thinking that maybe we just see if like anybody in the comments has any ideas or anything like that. And yeah. then we just yeah, move on. and then we just move on to phase two of the testing because I had something else that I wanted to test. What's that? Um, somebody in the comments said that we should try it with protection 200. Now, obviously, oh. obviously, we'll have to use commands in order to do that. But I still think that's worth doing just to see what happens. Just regular protection? Uh, projectile protection 200. It won't do any good at that level. You're right. It's just going to max out, isn't it? It's going to max out at 80%. So it doesn't matter how strong the protection is. 80% is still the cap. Oh. But through creative commands, maybe it would work. All right. It's worth a shot, you think? Definitely. Yeah, I, I think it's worth a shot. Okay. My original plan for the projectile protection armor was that we could just issue a command from the console and that would pump up some armor and then we could save it in a museum so people couldn't actually use the armor. And it didn't feel like it'd be too cheated to do that, but it ended up not being that easy. We're actually going to need command blocks in order to get that done. And neither of us are opt for very good reasons. So we can't actually use command blocks. So it started to feel really kind of cheaty if we try to do that in our vanilla world so i've loaded up a copy of our world and we're going to do that here instead and here we can actually switch to create a mode at our heart's content and set up command blocks do whatever we want and then we can switch back to vanilla and shoot each other with a cannon to our heart's content and i've got a few other ideas of things that we can try as well so i think this should still be pretty fun so uh projectile protection Enchantment dot level dot two hundred. <laughs> it's very official. Yeah, very official. All right, so we've got notch apples and we got a splash potion to turtle master. That's a little bit faster to use. Incoming. Oh man, that never gets old. <laughs> oh, and I, I had a totem. It would have killed me though, but I, I had a totem again. Cause I oh, man. the last thing I was doing that this world download was when I was working on the raid farm. Are you loaded up? Yeah, it's ready. All right, apple, splash, shield, ready. Fire. <laughs> uh, that actually disintegrated my shield. Your shield's gone? And I'm alive. What? It disintegrated. Sure. It, 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 <laughs> it blocked it. Like I felt that like it, it made the noise and then my shield disappeared. Okay, so whoa, whoa, whoa. what'd you do? Where I don't know. I was just standing. I don't know what I was doing different. It just uh, worked. Uh, Are you you ready? Yep. Firing. Oh, what did you do? I don't know. 
you did something perfect. Like okay. you did something right. Okay, but what's interesting is that that was projectile protection two hundred armor. Did it take any damage? Uh, I'm sure. Let's let's take a look at the armor itself. Oh yeah, the armor took damage, and uh, How bad. It, it's about the same as what we've been seeing. Looks really? About, yeah, it looks about the same. So in breaking it doesn't play effect on that? That's weird. Uh oh yeah, it is a little bit more. Yeah, no, yeah, it's definitely a little bit more. Um, uh, but it's not not as much as you'd think. Did you figure uh, okay. out what to do with the shield? Okay. The shield you do not look directly up with. You look just a little bit below full. Oh, is that and, that's what does yeah. it? You do not look directly up with it. Three arrows and All right. I'm ready to fire. Go for it. Firing. I that that activated. The the shield activated? The shield's gone. The shield's gone. So it killed you through a notch apple, through the resistance potion, through, through the, the armor, through the shield. Like we thought it would. Potion has been splashed. Fiery. Still dead. Did the shield work? Yeah, I heard the shield go off twice in a row now. So that is definitely work. That's awesome. The wiki says the shield directionally blocks all attacks coming from within 90 degrees of the direction the wielder is facing, providing a full hemisphere of coverage to them. If the wielder faces straight up or face straight down, they are likely to miss their blocks. Wow, that's some good information. Yeah, so that that might be it. Here we go. I'm going to die. Yeah, I definitely heard the shield go off. That's that's actually working. So as predicted, it appears that using any sort of vanilla methods, you know, the resistance, the absorption, full armor, shield, three arrows will kill you no matter what. And it looks like we could probably survive two arrows. I don't think there's a lot of point in continuing to test that. We already spent a lot of time on that. And extra projectile protection all the way up to level 200 didn't seem to help at all. What about like a whole bunch of hearts? So really with the armor we're using right now, we actually have projectile protection 800. However, the game limits the damage received no matter what the level of projectile protection can be to 80%. So two pieces of armor in vanilla, basically the maximum we were receiving with damage reduction. However, with the absorption and the health boost, there are some significant survival ability options we have. I think that through cheaty commands, we could actually survive three shots out of this thing, but vanilla, the limitation is most definitely two. That is filling up most of my screen with hearts. Yeah, I had uh, uh, level 100 and absorption and health boost, which is a lot of health. They go up to um, 255, by the way. Yes, I, I didn't want to go all the way up there just right away. I wanted to make sure I could test it first. I, wanna, um, I wonder what it would take to kill all this in one hit. Well, why don't we find out? <laughs> like, how many arrows do you think it would take? You want to place uh, your bets? Uh, five. I don't think five would. Uh, okay, so with armor or without armor? Do I with add all armor. the... So all the full Everything protections? We've Everything we've been doing so far. There's no way five arrows is going to kill all this. There's I've no five way. Arrows will kill it. If you can kill an Ender Dragon with 1,200 HP, I think you can... Is that what they've got? But, but like, we're reducing the damage to like 5% with all these extra effects. Oh, yeah. The, the golden apple doesn't do anything, does it? Not anymore. Not anymore. Okay. I've got them all primed. Okay, I'm ready to splash. Splashing. Oh, hang on. The last one didn't go through, so you're going to have to deal with six. Okay, that's fine. I don't think six will kill and me. And fire. Ready. This is so many hearts. Oh, you're dead. Uh, no. Oh. I didn't take any I mean my armor took a beating my my shield didn't I don't even see any heart damage How much absorption damage did you take though? Uh it looks like none of it. Oh, uh maybe yeah okay, I did take a couple rows. It's hard to tell cuz there's so many rows, but I did take a couple rows of absorption uh, damage. You've got a bunch of arrows in you. I think I'm going to line up 20 in there. All right. Let's go for 20. 
<laughs> like straight from six to twenty. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty arrows. Okay, I'm ready to splash when you're ready to go. I'm ready to fire. Splashing. Firing. Shield. This is not going to kill me. I'm betting you. <laughs> no way. It did not even do that much damage. Oh my goodness. I wonder if there's a max. There's a way we could uh, set a scoreboard up for hearts, couldn't we? Uh, maybe. We could try that. All right, so you got a scoreboard. I have 2,048 hearts. All right, I'm ready. Firing. Man, this doesn't get old. <laughs> Eighteen hundred. That actually did a decent amount of damage. Two hundred health is more than any player's ever. Yeah. Okay. All right. I I have an idea. Let's just throw away all the armor. I just see how much raw damage you can do to me without a shield. Just period. How many arrows you want? Just as many as you can load in there. Just see how much raw damage you can do. I want to start off with two. All right. Let's see what two does. All right, and you're not shielding or anything? Nothing. I got, okay. I got no armor, no shield. I, I mean, I have a bunch of absorption hearts, but... Let's see, I have it. Oh, my... Whoa! <laughs> that, was, that was so much damage! Wow! That was only two... That was two arrows? Yeah, that was two arrows. You want to go three? Yeah, let's go three. Let's go three. One. So that, that resistance... And everything, and the uh, armor, the projectile protection, that plays a big role. Yeah, it does. All right, here we go. Yeah, I don't need to get ready, because I'm just standing here. Okay, that still took you to 800. Let me do four. That's interesting. That's weird. I think there's a limit to the number of arrows that do damage. That might be. I want to die from this. That'd be fantastic. But it looks like it's the same amount of damage. That's interesting. All right, do one arrow with no absorption. Yeah. And then turn your regen off, too. Oh, uh... We'll catch a number better that way. Okay. All right, one arrow. One arrow. Fire. I'm going to die. <laughs> <laughs> that did a thousand damage. That no is crazy. Way. That wow. dragon doesn't stand a chance. No, he never had any chance whatsoever. That is, I don't know why. So I'm a little bit curious why three hearts makes a difference or three arrows makes a difference. Maybe it's just that little extra bit more of damage that'll kill somebody through all the extra bonuses. Maybe the, maybe the arrow, the extra arrows will break through the protection a little bit better. I'm not sure exactly why that is, but it seems like it doesn't matter how many arrows we use if we're not using all the extra protection, that it's doing somewhere around the $1,200 uh, damage, which is, which is amazing. I think my working theory is that the first arrow destroys the shield, mostly. The second one destroys the shield and damages your armor a little bit. The third one kills you. Ah, that's interesting. Okay. But then it, for just raw damage, it, the arrows don't seem to play much of a role. I think as soon as you take any damage, you're immune. Oh, for for like a split second? Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's... that's it still was a lot of fun. There was some, there were some cool things that happened. I was surprised when I took... I took a thousand damage and died from that hit. That was pretty awesome. Not sure how much it's coming through. Man, you take forever to kill. You're like God. I had a two thousand health. Do you got anything that does more damage? Like say a rail cannon? <laughs> oh my god, the hearts are even showing up in my F five screen. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. This is so much work. <laughs> <laughs> Every 
block after three blocks is half a heart of damage without feather falling. Okay, so a hundred thousand blocks. So My... you have two thousand HP. You'll need to fall two thousand and fifty-one blocks. Two thousand fifty-one blocks, huh? Okay, because from, uh... from the surface of anywhere. All right, let's do three thousand. Five. Five. Oh, here's the real cannon. Four. Three, three, two, two one. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on, I got an idea. Alright. This should be a good way to end you. Command block, huh? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Look at the sky! Have you seen the sky? <laughs> I'm still not dead! I've been struck by like a thousand lightning bolts. What? Why am I flying? Oh, you gave me levitate. <laughs> I feel like I'm ascending. Uh oh. Oh no! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh no, here he goes! <laughs> Boom! <laughs> <Sorry. sighs>